When there's heavy rain in the forecast, people in flood prone areas take notice. That includes businesses within the River Chase Village Shopping Center and drivers who often find high water on Montgomery Highway, which passes by it. The flooding is blamed on a collapsed storm sewer. It's something the city was willing to go to court over in September. Tonight, ABC 3340's Valerie Bell is working for you to get answers and Valerie, any progress on getting those repairs done. Brenda, it was in mid-September when Hoover City Council members voted to authorize the city's legal team to file a lawsuit against property owners. We checked today and found nothing has been filed in either state or federal court. The city attorney tells me this evening their office is reviewing the city's legal options, but anticipates filing a lawsuit if property owners don't take immediate action. Here's a look at the Hoover City Council meeting back in September. It declares a public nuisance. It's where the city declared a stormwater drainage problem to be a public safety hazard. Three months ago, City Administrator Alan Rice spoke with ABC 3340 about that. Now that the Hoover City Council has determined that this is a public nuisance, our city attorney will work on filing paperwork with the court to obtain a court order for those repairs to be made. Either the private property owner can make those repairs or the city actually will be able to go in and make the repairs and then recover taxpayer funds from the property owner. Since then, there are no publicly available legal filings on record. So we reached out to city leaders. They declined to speak with us on camera. The two property owners had representatives present for that mid-September meeting. Neither disputed the issue, nor did they take responsibility for the problem. There is no failed pipe under my client's land. In fact, both claimed it's Hoover's responsibility to repair failing infrastructure. It's inappropriate to declare something a public nuisance for which the city bears responsibility to, to operate and maintain. The city itself is contributing a substantial amount of stormwater runoff into the pipe and the system that has failed. Now, the city attorney says the property owners have done some work in the past, but that work has proven insufficient as Highway 31 is still flooding during heavy rain events. The email I received goes on to say maintenance of the drainage pipe is the responsibility of the private property owners. I've reached out to the attorneys representing the property owners and have not heard back. Brenda. Valerie Bell reporting.